If you're a homeowner in Brantford, the recent 6.9% increase in average sales prices this year is great news. You're probably wondering what your next move should be. But what does that mean if you're a buyer in the same market? I'm Matt Allman from The Crew Real Estate at Redline Properties, and this is Matt Stats. Trying to get into an increasing market can be a difficult process without the proper guidance. Your realtor will be able to show you what neighborhoods are increasing in value and where you should be investing your money. Let's take a look at the average neighborhood sale prices here in Brantford in 2019. Homes in Eagle Place experienced the most growth percentage-wise at 12.4%, which works out to almost $35,500 in increase. Homes in Eagle Place were almost $100,000 cheaper than the city's average, which shows that buyers were getting realtor cliche alert, a great return on investment. So what if you want to get into the market but the neighborhood you want to live in isn't within budget? Check out this strategy. Step 1. Rent a property in the neighborhood you'd like to live in. Step 2. Talk with your realtor about investing in a property in a neighborhood that shows steady growth, that you can charge enough rent for to cover the mortgage, and put some money back into your pocket. Step 3. After a couple years, you should have built up a decent amount of equity to refinance the property and use that equity for a down payment on a home in your preferred neighborhood or repeat the process and purchase another property for income purposes. If you have any questions about this strategy or any of the stats we've talked about in previous episodes, hit up the comments below or reach out by text, call or email.